Hi, I'm Emily from Respiratory. Hi. Could I have your last name and date of birth? Uh, Becker, 11 25, 1996. Okay, can I see your wristband? Yep, I confirm that with the chart. I'm looking at, looking at your chart, I see that you had an upper abdominal surgery, which indicates consented spirometry. I'm looking at your overall appearance. Your breathing. I'm looking at your vitals, and I'm also going to listen. Yeah, also. So your upper abdominal surgery indicates us doing incentive spirometry, which will kind of show us the capacity and volumes of your lungs in order to kind of assess where you're at. Your height is 5'11", which would show that your predicted body weight would be about 70.3 kilograms. That multiplied by 12 would be 843.6 milliliters for your predicted minimal inspiratory capacity, which is all, all the math is listed. Okay. So to do the incentive spirometry, I will have you take a normal breath out like you would when you're regularly breathing and then take a nice, slow, deep breath in as far as you can. And I'll have you do that about 10 times per hour. Okay. Let me know if it's uncomfortable at any point. I'll have you do that through the mouthpiece. Again, we are measuring your inhale, not the exhale. You could be using um, a clip for the nose, but Seems like she's getting good numbers, so it wouldn't exactly be needed. If she was getting worse numbers than her predicted, then you would possibly be good. Okay, so now she has finished doing 10 of those. And now I'm going to reassess. I will, I'll listen again. And Okay, I'll listen. Um, her numbers were basically maxing it out every time, which would be about like 2,500 milliliters, her predicted being 843.6. So she is far above her predicted. So the outlook is looking good. Wouldn't be indicating anything at this time, but because of your upper abdominal surgery, I will. I would still like you to do that 10 times per hour. Sounds good. Do you feel like you understand how to use the equipment? Yep. Is there anything else that I can do for you? I don't think so. Okay. Could I have you give me a nice cough? <coughs> okay. And it doesn't seem like she got anything up. If she did get any type of sputum up and coughed it into like a... Um, tissue or napkin or anything like that, I would assess the sputum as well. Is there anything else that um, you need from me today? I don't think so. Okay, sounds good. I'm going to chart everything and let everyone know. Um, we'll let your provider know and your care team. And I hope you have a good rest of your day. So I'm going to take off my gloves and decontaminate my hands and my equipment the scope and now that she knows how to do it I will leave it at bedside for her to do as she understands. Bye. Bye.